Everyone, today we're going to be doing a quick programming video using the Castle Link field card, and um, we're going to jump right in. So, step one unplug your ESC feed to, from your receiver, then plug it into your card. Step two turn it on. Step three press the button. And every time you press the button, this will go down. Every time you hold down the button, it will move across. So you can choose your variable. A um, couple questions we've had is punch control is amount the amount the motor will accelerate. So the less, I mean the more punch control you have, the less your motor will accelerate super fast. So basically the traction control system, so you won't get wheel spin. Because you don't always want just straight out acceleration because you'll get wheel spin. Um, another thing is the motor timing. Motor timing um, on the highest setting will accelerate faster, will have more power, will have more top speed, but you have to watch your motor temperatures because you can overheat. So usually I keep it on the lowest because these castle systems have so much power anyway. And that's pretty much it. I definitely suggest, as I've said before, buying this system instead of just the Castle Link because the, this system is like $5 more and it comes with this card and you can still plug it into the computer right here. So you can, so it's a Castle Link and it's a field card for only $5 more. I don't know why anyone buys the other one. Okay, after that, unplug. Plug back into your receiver, and you're ready to run. Hope you liked our video. Please like and subscribe. Uh, leave a comment, and see you all next time.